Hello, this pair presents version 2 of Digital Image Auto Rotate with new automatic frames for your photos. Everything is done automatically and you can even use any frame you will find on the web and it will automatically adjust to fit your photos. Let's see how it works. Now we click on settings and now we need to select frame. Here are a few built-in frame templates you can use and there are even much more. We can see the preview by pressing the refresh button. We click OK to accept the settings and now we need to set the folder that contains the images. We can drag and drop it into the container. We can delete our older digital image auto rotate test. Now we will see the frames on your photos. Let's take a look. Simply amazing. Everything is automatically adjusted. Horizontal or vertical, it does not matter. Now, let's see how we take a frame from the web and use it in Digital Image Auto Rotate Automatic Framing. Let's select a frame from Google Images that fit our needs. Usually, it's recommended to use large photos to get higher resolution to have better quality for your framing. Let's select this one. It looks nice. It's important to have transparency inside the frame so Digital Image Auto Rotate can use it. Now we saved the frame into our desktop. Let's go to the settings again. Now we need to select the frame we just saved in our desktop. Let's press refresh and we see a preview of it. Automatic chairs adjust to protect images is automatically on so it will fit also portrait images. Let's see the result. If we press yes, we see the folder that we, the, we created. As you see, it fits perfectly to your images. With just a few clicks, you can make absolutely amazing frames. You can find frames from the web. You can use the built-in frames from the program. You can do actually unlimited options and things with it. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for other tutorials about digital image auto-rotate. Thank you.